Hello everybody, welcome back to the, what is probably the finale episode of, of The Adventures of Jim Shepard, uh, presented to you by Super High Bros. Yeah, season, not season finale. I keep saying season finale, series finale. Sure. <laughs> Let's do this. Made a bunch of made a bunch of oopsies and then just went with it. <laughs> <coughs> huh. uh, Where the hell we gotta go? I don't oh, the know. computer down there. Gotta interact with it. It just did. Really? Yeah. But this one. I really hope I have not just gone horribly the wrong way. <laughs> oh, hey, look, this where, this where we came out. It's up here. Neat. We're already here. Yeah, we're up here now, which means now we can leave. We're gonna be done this real soon. We're about to be done this real soon, folks. I There's not a lot left. Museums, but I never Ooh. dreamed I would discover anything like this. This bunker might have been the last refuge of their entire species. Just imagine what mysteries it might hold. Imagine what secrets it might reveal. Please, really try to remember why I we're here. Saren, the enjoyable. conduit, the fate of the Jimmy, entire known galaxy. Yeah, I hate this game. I am sorry. I had a bit of fun playing it, though. Still I don't just like hope it. we have the opportunity to no, study it. Yeah. What are all those things no on the wall? Some kind of containers? containers? It just looks nice they and feels like nice and plays nice. The Perthians probably tried to keep themselves thing. alive through cryogenic freezing. Much nicer experience. Something must have gone wrong. This bunker... Oh, shit! What was that? Rocket bug. It knocked, it interrupted the. It interrupted the monologue. How dare you fuck up my monologue? It wasn't even mine, I think it was Tommy. <laughs> when I played this on Insanity, there were a lot more guys here. <laughs> What is happening? It's a trap! Saren must have set an ambush! I do not think Saren is behind this. But there's a convenient open door over here. We turn all the way around like that. <laughs> I have studied the Protheans for decades, but I have never felt this There's sense of foreboding. What will we find down there? You have to give it that. Whatever we find, <laughs> be cautious. If this were simply an automated trap, Saturn would have triggered it as well. You are not Prothean. But you are not machine either. This eventuality was one of many that was anticipated. This is why we sent our warning through the beacons. Looks like some kind of VI program. 
pretty badly damaged. I do not sense the taint of indoctrination upon any of you. Unlike the other that passed recently, perhaps there is still hope. This is incredible. An actual Prothean VI, and I can understand it. I have been monitoring your communication since you arrived at this facility. I have translated my output into a format you will comprehend. My name is Vigil. You are safe here for the moment, but that is likely to change. Soon, nowhere will be safe. Why did you bring me here? You must break a cycle that has continued for millions of years. But to stop it, you must understand, or you will make the same mistakes we did. The Citadel is the heart of your civilization and the seat of government, as it was with us and as it has been with every civilization that came before us. But the Citadel is a trap. The station is actually an enormous mass relay, one that links to dark space, the empty void beyond the galaxy's horizon. When the Citadel relay is activated, the Reapers will pour through, and all you know will be destroyed. Reapers can wipe out the council and the entire Citadel fleet yeah. in a single surprise attack. That was our fate. Our leaders were dead before we even realized we were under attack. The Reapers seized control of the Citadel and threw it the mass relays. Communication and transportation across our empire were crippled. Each star system was isolated, cut off from the others. Easy prey for the Reaper fleets. And Over the next candy. decades, the Although Reapers systematically like obliterated our people. To, uh, world by world, system by system, to, uh, they methodically over. wiped us out. Uh, to, or not to take over, but to be the uh, human counselor, I believe. Yeah. Some of you must have managed to survive. Through the Citadel, the Reapers had access to all our records, maps, census data. Information is their fleets advanced across every settled region of the galaxy. Some worlds were utterly destroyed. Others were conquered, their populations enslaved. These indoctrinated servants became sleeper agents under Reaper control. Taken in as refugees by other Protheans, they betrayed them to the machines. Within a few centuries, the Reapers had killed or enslaved every Prothean in the galaxy. They were relentless, brutal, and absolutely thorough. You said you brought me here for a reason. The conduit is the key. Before the Reapers, Ilos was a top secret facility. Here, researchers worked to create a small scale. The conduit is not a weapon. It is a backdoor onto the Citadel. What happened next? We severed all communication with the outside, and our facility went dark. To conserve resources, everyone was put into cryogenic stasis, but the genocide of an entire species is a long, slow process. Years passed. Decades, centuries, the Reapers persisted, and my energy reserves were dwindling. You should have fought. We were a few hundred against a galactic invasion fleet. Our only hope was to remain undetected. I began to disable the life support of non-essential personnel. First support staff, then security. One by one, their pods were shut down to conserve energy. Eventually, only the stasis pods of the top scientists remained active. Even these were in danger of failing when the Reapers finally retreated back through the Citadel relay. There were hundreds of stasis pods out there. You just shut them down? You killed them? You were programmed to protect them, not kill them. This outcome was not completely unforeseen. My actions were a result of contingency programming entered on my creation. I bet they didn't tell the non-essential I staff. saved key personnel. When the Reapers retreated, the top researchers were still alive. When the researchers woke, they realized the Prothean species was doomed. There were only a dozen in, yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning. A way to break the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. Aren't they under the influence yeah. of the Reapers? The Keepers are so controlled by the Citadel. Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the Keepers to activate the Citadel relay. Fuck. At this time, 
When it's Sovereign sent closer. the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers ignored it. No. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. Saren can use the conduit to bypass all the Citadel's external defenses. Correct. And once inside, he can trap Sovereign will override the Citadel systems and manually open the relay. Is there any way we can stop them? There's a data file in my console. Take a cop, it will corrupt the Citadel security protocols. Wait, where's the Citadel's master control unit? I've never heard of anything Through like that. Through the conduit. Follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. Saren's got enough of a head start. Grab that data file oh, and let's go. Christ. Shepard, are you sure? Who knows how much longer Vigil will be here? Even now the projection is weak. This might be our only chance to speak with it, our only link to the knowledge of the Protheans. It is the opportunity of a lifetime. I'm sorry, Liara. We have to stop Saren. Nothing else matters. You are right. I am sorry. My personal feelings clouded my judgment. <laughs> I am sorry. We... we should go. <laughs> the one I'm you call Saren has not so reached the machine. conduit. <laughs> not yet. There is still hope if you hurry. I have to get there before they just, just get past the bad guys. Incredible. We don't have time to admire the view. We have to get through that relay, and these oh, guests so aren't going to make it easy on us. Okay. I thought I'd just a cut thing and it just stopped you dead at a weird ass angle. <laughs> Seal the station! 
arms aren't moving. Systems not responding. Abandon the Citadel! Evacuate the Council! Citadel Control! Citadel Control, do you copy? Terrence Bartorn there has got a gap on. He's even more augmented than he was before. Let's go, Terrence! Hang on! Things are going to get really rough. I didn't realize there's a countdown. Uh, why do we keep stopping? Come on! It's just... What you going through hyperspace? In a fucking thing with wheels on it. <sighs> Critical failures detected across all monitored systems. Please Wait begin for it. emergency evacuation. <laughs> Inside the arms.
and somehow that kept working. God, I sound like, um, who's Morty's dad? Jerry. God, I sound like Jerry. <laughs> Wrong like, way. I just kept crawling nope. and it kept that working. Way. Wrong way. This way? Yeah. Go up, turn right.
took a rocket. <laughs> Level transition. <laughs> That's the fix. It always happens right at the end there for some reason. Every time. Uh, here we go, the Saren fight. And the choice to save the... Whatchamacallit. Oh, God damn it, game! Really? Where's the audio? Yeah, we just lost audio. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Don't worry, I'll feel it. Pew 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 That 
It'll happen with the, with the <laughs> Saren fight, probably. Here we go. Want to see how you do the easiest boss fight ever? <laughs> sure. Give it a second. You can. Oh, for God's sake, the audio is gone again. Okay. Why? I was afraid you would oh, make it in back. time, Shepard. In time for what? The no, final no, I just confrontation. Back this, 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 I now. think we both expected it Folks? to end like this. Like, I, lost, I cannot you know believe that, this. <laughs> in a few minutes, yeah, Sovereign will have full control of all the Citadel yeah. systems. <laughs> the relay will open. The Reapers will return. I've still got a few tricks up my sleeve. You survived our encounter oh, on Vermeyer, but I've changed since then. Improved. Sovereign has upgraded me. You're still dead. You let Sovereign off. implant you? Are you insane? I suppose I should thank you, Shepard. After Vermeyer, I couldn't stop Did thinking you about what you said. Off about so Sovereign manipulating me. About indoctrination. Really? Yes. The doubts began to <laughs> eat away at me. Yes. Sovereign sensed my it's hesitation. Really it makes it super I was easy. We skip the whole first part. To strengthen my resolve. Now my doubts are gone. Thing. Thing. I believe in sovereign completely. I understand that the Reapers need organics. Join us, and Sovereign will find a place for you too. Sovereign's controlling you through your implants. Don't you see that? The relationship is symbiotic. Organic and machine intertwined. A union of flesh and steel. The strengths of both, the weaknesses of neither. I am a vision of the future, Shepard. The evolution of all organic crazy. life. This is our destiny. Join Sovereign and experience a true rebirth. Sovereign hasn't won yet. I can stop it from do? taking control Daddy, of the station. Right Step aside and the invasion will never happen. We can't stop it, not forever. For you saw the visions. <laughs> you saw what happened to the Protheans. The Reapers are too powerful. Both of these are correct. <laughs> Some part of you must still realize this is wrong. You can fight this. Maybe you're right. Maybe there is still a chance for... for... <laughs> Sovereign is too strong. I'm sorry. It is too late for me. It's not over yet. You, you can do, still do, redeem do, yourself. Do. Goodbye, Shepard. Thank uh. you. No. <laughs> There's still more. Vigil's data file over. worked. I just I've got control of all systems. Quick, the so there weren't any open more. the station's <laughs> arms. Maybe the fleet can take Sovereign down before he regains control of the station. See if you can open a communications channel. The Destiny Ascension. Main drives offline. Kinetic barriers down 40%. The Council is on board. I repeat, the Council is on board. Normandy to the Citadel. Normandy to the Citadel. Please tell me that's you, Commander. No, I'm here, Joker. Caught that distress call, Commander. <laughs> Dude, that I'm bastard. sitting here in the Endura sector with I the entire Arcturus fleet. Stand. We can save the that Ascension. Just too. unlock the relays around the Citadel. We'll send the cavalry in. Are you sure I'm about this, Shepard? Human like casualties will be very high if you send going. your fleet in now. It this is bigger than humanity. Sovereign is a threat to every organic species in the galaxy. True. That's why you can't waste Very reinforcements handy. trying to save the Council. You must hold them back until the Citadel arms open up and the human fleet can go after Sovereign. What's the order, Commander? Come in now to save the Ascension, or hold back? Save the Council. Opening the relays now, Joker. We need to save the yeah, Ascension, no I matter what the cost. I there. hope the Council appreciates this. Elias. 
Advance ships, move in. Save the Destiny Ascension. Commander, we're picking up reinforcements. It's the Alliance. Thank the Goddess. Make sure he's dead. Make sure he's dead. He's not dead. Well, I mean, Saren is dead. Sovereign isn't. <laughs> He's dead. He already shot him. He already blew his own brains out and then she went and shot him in the same way. What was that going to call him another sword? monster down no matter what the cost.
did literally the end of the game. Yeah, we just beat it? Pretty much, yes. There's nothing, nothing else I've been expecting. Over, you're safe now. Where's the commander? Ambassador, Captain, there you Commander go. Shepard. Pretty much the last bit of the game. The we have gathered last here to recognize the, the enormous contributions of the Alliance forces in the war against Sovereign and the Geth. Many humans lost <laughs> their lives and in the battle to save the city. Fuck you, to brave <laughs> and courageous soldiers <laughs> who willingly yeah, gave their himself. lives so that we, the Council, might live. There is no greater sacrifice, we to Mass Effect and we Trish. share your we'll grief understand. over the tragic Why loss of so many noble men and women. The Council also owes you a great personal debt, Commander, one we can never repay. You saved not just our lives, but the lives of billions from Sovereign and the Reapers. Commander Shepard, your heroic and selfless actions serve as a symbol of everything humanity and the Alliance stand for. And though we cannot bring back those valiant soldiers who gave their lives to save ours, we can honor their memories through our actions. Mm. Humanity has shown it is ready to stand as a defender and protector of the galaxy. You have proved you are worthy to join our ranks and serve beside us on the Citadel Council. Counselor, on behalf of Humanity and the Alliance, we thank you for this prestigious honor and humbly accept. We will need a list of potential candidates to fill Humanity's seat on the Council. Given all that has happened, I am sure your recommendation will carry a great deal of weight, Commander. Do you support any particular candidate? We need someone with the courage to stand up for what he believes in. Someone like Captain Anderson. Him? You must be joking. Anderson prefers to let his fists do the talking. Only with you, Ambassador. Only with you. 
Are you sure about this, Commander? The captain's a soldier, not a politician. <laughs> I'm not picking you. <laughs> I'd rather have the captain on the council than any politician I know. I think it's an inspired choice. The council would welcome him with open arms, <coughs> should he accept. I'm honored, Counselor. As humanity's they representative, I'm not I'll do everything in my power to help the council rebuild. Sovereign's defeat marks the beginning of a new you know era don't like for you. both humanity and the council. You literally sold me out. You thought I wasn't gonna. You thought I was gonna just forget that. <laughs> oh. Sovereign was only a vanguard. The Reaper oh fleet God, is still please. coming. Hundreds of ships. I think we're at the end now. Shepard's right. Humanity is ready to do its part. United with the rest of the Council, we have the strength to overcome any challenge. When the Reapers come, we must stand side by side. We must fight against them as one. And together, we will drive them back into dark space. And end of the game. Alright, everybody, and that's the conclusion of Mass Effect 1. Just slow zoom in on us. <laughs> it's still zooming in. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> Done. Perfect. All right, everybody. Thanks uh, again for tuning in, Super High Bros. Yep. See you, look. We beat the game. Thank you. Whoa. Super High Bros out. Yeah, for the final time on Mass Effect, we are out.